Hey there, Rusty Kern from Playset Magazine back at the project table with a sticky issue that has plagued collectors for decades. I'm talking about price tags, sale tags, uh, stickers, uh, tape used to close a box, all that stuff. We found that if you start to take it off, rip, you do it one time and you never try again. Uh, I'm going to try to give you some courage to try something new. All you need really is uh, some Ronson lighter fluid. We've got two projects. One is the Air Force Missile Center. I don't want to say rare, but maybe rare. Uh, place it in the Marks line. And the other one is the Ideal Pirate Ship, which is a big favorite of mine. The one I got at the Chicago show this past year has a bit of a problem on the front. Let's take a look. Here you are, yeah. Beautiful box and look at that taped on sticker. The old tape residue and glue has really sunk right in there and loves to live it and just hates to leave. So Ronson's lighter fluid it actually says it's excellent for removing labels. Turning the box around, I don't get seasick or anything. This side's lifting up a little bit, but it runs into a little bit of problem. So what I'm gonna do, I'm going but, to uh, lift this up a little bit more. And now I'm going to spread my lighter fluid under there. You see how that's doing that? Now, uh, don't be alarmed. Do you see how that's spreading a little bit on the box lithograph? That's okay. Now, I'll tell you who was a master at all of this was uh, Dr. Box. He really was able to fix boxes and what have you. So you got to be very careful right on that P. I'm getting a little like excited here see I'm talking about Dr. Box. Let this dry for a little bit just to give it some breathing room and you can see that there's no trace really of the lighter fluid but I've run into a couple of problems here a couple areas that are fairly stiff um, they're just not interested in giving way. All you do is come around from the other side come around from behind and back in here see? and you start to lift it up this way uh, anything you can do. I'm down now pretty much because of that to this area here and that's what I've got to work on a little bit. Well I've been cleaning up this Air Force Missile Center uh, the number 2686. It is not a common set and I've been trying to be very careful with the uh, box itself but if you see down here on the end right here I got tape I got tape up here a lot down the sides. They're not making lighters that much anymore. I hope they don't get rid of this stuff, but here's how you do it. Spray it on. Scary as heck, isn't it? Now this tape has been on here for I don't know how long, but something about the lighter fluid gets underneath the tape and you feel like, uh-oh, heart attack time. I'm going to have a terribly uh, stained box, like here, 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 here. But that's not really the way it works out. So I'm able to get up under this. The tape, something about it, th makes it eat the glue off the back of the tape. See that? So here it starts to come, right there. And the thing is, it doesn't stain the box. And it doesn't pull up the, the, the inking that Mark's used. See, a moment ago, I wasn't able to get this tape off. But looky here. Well, so you got to be careful. I'm trying to do this quick for you. But you can see now that tape is off. It was on. Now it's off. Over here is another one that I pulled off already. See that? And that's how that's done. Now it won't be long that this side will look just like this side. There's, you can see no stain marks from that tape. And it's starting to clear off. We'll just let this run a second. And I'm going to do the same thing right here. Let's put that on. You can see it kind of flooding out here. All right? Okay. So that's soaked in. Here I am lifting it up. Very gently. I'm not really pulling. I'm just letting it pop off, kind of. If that makes sense. All 
it leaves a little bit of a white snow behind it. I think that's the dissolved tape. Now if I run into a spot, and here it is, it's not wanting to go anywhere. I just hit it with a little more. Wow, see that pop off? Woo, done. And in the meantime, Yeah, look at that. So that's how my label came off my box uh, on my new Ideal Pirate Ship. And I'm going to have this whole thing ship shape here pretty quick too. Maybe we'll do something on cleaning up your pirate ship. But until then, I hope this helps you. Great hunting. And we'll see you on the pages of Playset Magazine.